the DJI Avita 3 is coming. And the leaks are wild. From major design changes to next level features, this could be DJI's biggest FPV upgrade yet. In this video, we're diving into everything that's leaked so far, what to expect, and when you can get your hands on it. Let's get into it. While the current Avita design pushes boundaries in FPV drone innovation, it still faces challenges, particularly with stability during gusty conditions. To overcome this, DJI should consider a deeper investment in computational fluid dynamics and comprehensive wind tunnel analysis. Refining the drone's aerodynamics could involve more than just tweaking the propeller guards. It may require reworking body contours and reconfiguring the internal component layout to create a more balanced center of gravity and efficient airflow. A sleeker, more aerodynamic profile would not only enhance in-flight stability, but also minimize air resistance. This could result in quieter operation and improved energy efficiency, directly translating to longer flight times. At the same time, exploring advanced composite materials, stronger, lighter, and more impact resistant, would improve durability without compromising performance, especially in high-speed, close-quarters flying environments. The rumored sensor upgrade from 1 by 1.7 inch to a full 1 inch isn't just an incremental improvement, it's a transformative shift in imaging potential. With a sensor that caliber, DJI has the opportunity to build a compact aerial platform that rivals high-end cinema gear. But this leap needs to be backed by more than size. Enhanced lens optics, refined image processing pipelines, superior dynamic range, and robust low-light performance should all be on the table. For content creators, Features like 10-bit color capture and variable aperture are no longer luxuries, they're necessities. These tools offer greater creative control and flexibility in post-production, essential for cinematic quality footage. On top of that, electronic image stabilization must evolve to work in tandem with the drone's mechanical stability, ensuring smooth footage even during aggressive flight maneuvers. Although the Avita series targets skilled FPV pilots, the inclusion of smarter, more adaptive obstacle avoidance would significantly broaden its appeal. We're not just talking about reactive systems that beep at walls. What's needed is proactive AI-based pathfinding that can anticipate and navigate around potential hazards in real time. Customizable avoidance settings could give pilots the freedom to fine-tune the system to match their unique flying style and environment, bridging the gap between creativity and safety. The rumored O3 Plus and Sync 4 Plus transmission system represents more than just an incremental upgrade. It's a foundation for redefining how pilots interact with their drones in real time. Beyond extending range, the focus must shift toward creating a communication link that thrives under pressure. Environments with dense RF interference, unpredictable signal loss, and dynamic flight patterns. To meet that challenge, DJI should look to next-generation solutions like intelligent frequency agility, real-time adaptive bitrate encoding, and re-engineered antenna rays that maintain signal integrity even at high speeds and low altitudes. A truly robust transmission system must deliver ultra-low latency video and telemetry in parallel, giving pilots not just a clearer view, but a deeper understanding of their aircraft status, position, and environment. High resolution, real-time feedback is crucial for FPV, especially when flying through complex or confined spaces where split-second decisions can make or break a shot. Battery life remains one of the most limiting factors in FPV performance. A five-minute increase might appear minor on paper, but in fast-paced aerial workflows, it could be the difference between capturing the shot or missing the moment. To push past these boundaries, DJI should explore next-gen battery solutions, potentially in the realm of solid-state or high-efficiency lipochemistries that deliver higher energy densities without compromising weight or safety. Equally important is how the drone uses that energy. An intelligent power management system capable of interpreting flight conditions, environmental stress, and pilot behavior could allocate resources dynamically, cutting unnecessary consumption and optimizing every watt of power. 
This would ensure not only longer flight times, but more consistent performance under demanding conditions. As for the launch, a spring release, possibly around April, fits well with DJI's typical rollout cadence. However, final timing will depend on a matrix of factors, from production scalability to global supply chain conditions. We can expect DJI to gradually build momentum through teaser campaigns, influencer previews, and controlled leaks to stir anticipation in the FPV community. In the end, the success of the Avita 3 won't rest solely on specs. It will hinge on whether it can deliver a truly immersive, responsive, and empowering flight experience. For the seasoned pilot, that means confidence. For the creative professional, it means freedom. And for the drone industry, it means another benchmark redefined.